Oh, that was so cool. I mean, uh, again, like, I, I don't even think people could really hear the long walk because it was so, the crowd was so loud. And, uh, but again, I don't think you needed to hear it to understand our message. But, you know, obviously the political climate here in Hawaii is a, is a little bit tense right now for our Native Hawaiians. And, uh, um, you know, there's a situation up on Mauna Kea, which I'm, I'm pretty heavily involved in. You know, I've flown back to the Big Island several times since this, uh, since, um, you know, the construction of the 30 meter telescope has started. And so I'm right up there with the Kia'i or the protectors. And so this walkout was dedicated to all the Kia'i. They're still up there on the Mauna. Um, and I just wanted to, I wanted to use all women, all Wahine, because, you know, I, I have my scholarship for young Native girls. Um, and it's just very important to me to um, represent the Mauna Wahine. Uh, and so I, I had these women come in, a lot of them were my um, family members, a lot of them were Kumu, uh, and they were also um, Mauna, we say Mauna Wahine, like they were the women of the Mauna. And so um, that was insane. Like I thought last year was emotional, but backstage when we were, when we went through everything, like I was seriously, my, I lost it, you know? And so that was like really, really, really special to me. And, um, they totally rocked it. Mahalo to all those Manawahine that came up there with me, and I, I hope that um, you know people understood our message, uh, regardless if you're from Hawaii or not. Now, let me